Okay, hey. Snack. I, I know I'm not supposed to be snacking, but not that I can snack to what I want. Yeah. I shouldn't say more. I'm not on vacation. What am I on? I'm not on vacation or nothing like that. I guess I'm on a break. Yeah. Get out of the freezer. Chocolate. The stuff is probably not good for you. Wait a second. Mmm. One more bite and do with the whole thing. Well, that stuff right there. Okay. Mmm. Got some mail. Institute on Voter Attitudes and Public Policy. Hey, you know. I just got a call. I call. I call my uh, associate in Dumbaza this morning in Africa. You know, rural, rural part of Eastern Cape. National Critical Issue Poll. Oh, look at this! A critical issue poll. Would you rate the President Trump's? Oh boy. Let's see there. Hey, I should mess. I should mess with these. But I won't do this now. I think I'm gonna do this. Hey, look at that. They give me... What is this for? Oh, this... I guess this is like return... I don't know what this are. Little sticker things. Put my name on it. Anthony Johnson, Little Chesapeake, blah, blah, blah. I don't know what that means. Okay, dear friend, has anyone ever offered you a penny for your thoughts? How about some free mailing labels? Oh, they gave me some free mailing labels. I read even a few minutes of your time with value. Then the close... 2019 National Critical Issues Poll is part of a nationwide public opinion survey designed to help us understand exactly what Americans want and expect from our elected officials and institutions. The survey consists of two dozen short uh, questions asking your opinion on issues of national and local importance. Your participation is crucial to make sure that I have a valid statistical sample of your public opinion. Who's I? Dr. Stephen Hammer, Director of Survey. In addition to enclosing the free labels, I better look up who Stephen Hammer is before I do that one, that's for sure. I'll keep the labels. And, uh, yeah, I guess I'll do that. Maybe I'll do that in another posting. Out right here in the back yard of my sister's house. It's a huge backyard, by the way. Um, do a little reading. Like that. But wait, wait, wait. let me talk to you about what message really happened. Message really There's some sort of... You know, they always do these these NGOs with the government stuff. They always have some sort of uh, program or something like that that they, you know, they, they come and try to help the youths. The youth, the youth. <laughs> anyway, so this is the thing. I think it's from, the age range from 19 to 30. The people in his class, his grouping, the 19 to 32, I think he said. Anyway, so they have, there's about 40 of them there, right? And I guess it's male and female. But it's some educational things, whatever it is. I don't know what they're um, well, they do it something. And anyway, so he had walked out the class today, or walked out, the, yeah, walked out the class today, or yesterday, whenever it is in South Africa. And um, yeah, there's the eight, six hours, seven hours ahead of us. And uh, what he said is that the the, the 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 lady, the woman, the white woman, like in the '80s, started yelling at him, or yelling at him, or yelling, you know, screaming, whatever it is, yelling at him. Let me tell you something about closer men. This is this is this is closer stronghold. That means that these are closer people, right? I don't know if this and this woman's supposed to come from I think um, uh, Netherlands, Netherlands. But anyway, what, uh, 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 let me just tell you something about uh, closer men, especially. I, I hitched a ride one time from um, from Alice up to um, I was going to uh, Fort Beaufort, like 20 minutes up, and I was, and I was it was, this, it was a man. He was late for some meeting, some. Um, uh, I don't know if it was um, whatever the, the agency was, and uh, so he said, you know, he said, he said, have you heard this? He said, um, uh, this woman, he said, she's, she's a she, she's a close up woman in charge of his grouping or whatever it was. Or she's a director or something like that. He said, she started, she's, she's yelling at us. He said, one thing, close up men don't like to be yelled at. Now, this is an older man telling me this. So I, you know, you, well, I, I knew this anyway. And you know, because this, this, there's certain things you just can't do. So when they come with this, with the, with, with the whole law about equality, you know, the, 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 whatever, I'm into that because I like the male-female balance. But the men, the women, have to retain their womanness. There's a way to do it. You know what I mean? You can't be yelling at a man, right? You just, it's just not, not it's just not allowed. Just, 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 just can't do it. Anyway, back, back to the point. So, but Mr. Coley tells me, he says. 
So he walked out the class, you know. And 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 so he have so you have this eighty whoever got these people this this education institute, this eighty year old woman has these young people and she's just yelling at them. She said he said there's another woman in her sixties, but she grew up in South Africa, she's white also. She grew up in South Africa and she speaks Tulsa. So that was that's little, and she knows what to do. But this old woman I mean, what they, how do they pull my 80 out of retirement to talk to some young, some, some young people? I mean, even, let me tell you something. I've taught all my life. Somehow, some, I've been in a situation. And what I, my, my technique used to be, like, I, I realized I can only talk to maybe, at the most, two generations lower than me. So maybe I talk to one generation lower than me, and I depend on them to talk to another, well, say two generations lower than me. But then I let, let that people talk to the next generation. It's hard for me. I can't. I don't know what's going on in a 19-year-old's mind, you know what I mean? I don't, I don't even know what's going on in a 30-year-old's mind. Well, I do. But you understand? So it's difficult for me that, that you know, a darn near 70 years old trying to, trying to, uh, to tell me, you know, talk to a, 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 even a, well, I guess a 40 would be all right, but certainly not a 30-year-old. Uh, when I, back when I was young, I we did this and we did that. They don't want to hear that. You know, I got to talk to the, basically the 50-year-old, you know, who can perhaps communicate with, with the 30-year-old, maybe not, you know what I mean? You understand? That's how it goes, you know what I mean? I can't be, now, don't get me wrong, because, just because of the way I am, I can talk to, I actually can talk to people, but I don't really talk to them as that. I mean, I do, I do the, um, the, the um, what we call the, uh, 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 the James Small way, when he talks to rites of passage, there's a, there's an age, I think it's about 65, when you're preparing, you, you, you're, you're always in preparation. Uh, but somewhere like say 50 to about 65, you're in preparation. You're, you're in your like your, your your junior eldership or something like that. But when you get 65, you're sort of in your eldership. You know what I mean? And you're preparing for for basically your 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 75 is your ancestral kind of thing. Something like that. I, I, I posted something. I'll, I'll do the rice. I'll, I'll, I'll do this rice of pass. I'll put the URL what he says. But see what happens when you're in the eldership like I am, like you're el over 65. If 65 between, say, 62, whatever, 65 to 75, let's put it that way. And what you do, basically, you're, you're an advisor. You know what I'm saying? You, you can only give advice, and you give advice not to be taken. You give advice, you say, hey, if the person asks you a question, you give advice. You don't try to hammer your point in or something like that. You say, oh, you wrong, blah, 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 because you, you're saying you're wrong from my perspective when I grew up, but when you grew up, things were different. Things are different now, so I can't, I can't, oh, they did kill a mosquito. Um, I can't be telling people, you know, I can't, I can't, like, like, like say for instance, for instance, the ADOS movement, I can't be telling, I can only give advice. If they take it, they take it. If they don't, they don't. Because I'm supposed to be doing some other stuff. You know what I mean? I was, in fact, I can only really, I'm only really supposed to be talking to like 65 or the eldership people. You know what I mean? And I can lay into them, you know, because you, that, 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 we're the same generation. We got the da 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 But I can't be telling no, I can't be yelling at no 30 year old because they're not doing what I think should be done. It doesn't make no sense. So anyway, that's Chloe's hand. Look, here's, what, here's what I told him to do. Here's what I advise him to do. You know, whether you know it or not. See, I've been hanging. I love 5150. You know, Corey Holcomb and the gang. You know, uh, 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 Craig Fax and, and Dolly and and, uh, and uh, 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 who else? Oh, uh, Zoe Williams and uh, and what's his name? The the the, uh, the, the Omega Sci-Fi Cap. You know, the religious Omega Sci-Fi Cap. But they have this thing they started doing a few weeks ago, about a month ago, whatever. They, if somebody's saying something they don't like. They say, yeah. Drowning them out, right? So I told him, I said, "Look, here's what you do, man. If, well, the, the only advice, hey, you know, you're not supposed to, you know what? If you know me, you don't have to take my advice. Like, what do I know? Here's what you do. If very low, you take, get a few of you folks. You start when that woman starts yelling or whatever they're doing that's wrong. You're just going, yeah, because you want to do instead of Serafina, where you walk out of the classroom. What you're trying to get." What you're trying to get this old woman to do is for her to walk out the classroom. And if you get some beef with, with the, you know, whoever, you know, whatever governmental, whatever, then they got to investigate what the heck's going on. Why this woman all upset? Then she can say what she said. Then you say, nah, I bet, you know, this is what happened, da, 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 da. So anyway, I just thought I'd tell you, I gave, I gave my advice as an elder, and, you know, it's just what, what I know, what I've experienced. That's it for me. T, for the fantasy, take the train to bed. Let you know what I only suspect. <laughs>